I just feel like if you're in the U.S., you want you want to go help Palestine, you want to go help Ukraine, please have a one way ticket and go there and defend them yourself. That's what I feel. Right. What made it worse is he apologized. In my opinion, he shouldn't have is because that's really what he thinks. Right. And the thing is, now he apologized. Everything that he says moving forward will get extremely scrutinized by everyone that's watching him. And plus, Asman has been under a microscope for a long time now since he's one of the platform's biggest streamers, content creators. And I feel like he wouldn't have gotten banned. And I know, now I feel, I know he wouldn't have gotten banned if he was streaming on Kick. Yeah, agreed with that. Yeah, yeah, it's like it's, if uh, Twitch wants to ban people because of that, at least exert it equally, not just selective, just because you you disagree with it. I mean, that, that's yeah. what, that's what I think. It's like you, especially I, I know Andrew from Legal Mindset has been covering a lot of this with regards to VTubers. So yeah, uh, Twitch is a ticking time bomb. It's only a matter of time before mm. Amazon shuts them down. That's really what I feel. It's like when I saw the writing on the wall, when I realized it, that's why I went full on YouTube. Yeah.